Hi, right, today we're going to be continuing our series of UpNote versus other note-taking apps. We're going to find out which is the better note app between these two apps. Today's other app is Simple Note. It is a completely free app, I believe made by WordPress. UpNote has a free plan. It also has a plan for 99 cents a month or $24.99 for a lifetime license, just a one-time purchase. First off, Simple Note has a very basic design. You won't see a whole lot of options in the entire app. Even when you click on the uh, options at the top of the screen, most of them are pretty basic. On the other hand, on UpNote, you have a lot of options. I'm going to slide this window over so you can see. You see the Rich Text Editor has a lot of options. You create a note fairly easily in both apps. On Simple Note, it's over here at the top. And on UpNote, it too is at the top of the screen. The basics of the way both apps look is in contrast. Simple Note has a basic user interface. It's pretty much all text based from the titles to the uh, text you would type into the body of a note. There's not a whole lot of options. On the other hand, UpNote has a very colorful user interface. There are notebook covers and there's a to-do list. It just offers a lot more options. Something I really disliked about Simple Note was doing something as simple as right clicking a note. There's no option to delete. You can create a note very quickly, but deleting one requires that you go across the app to the other side, click the ellipsis, and then move the note to the trash. In UpNote, however, you are able to right click on any note and move it to the trash. You can also add it to a notebook. You can pin it to the top of the screen. There's just a lot more options with UpNote. With Simple Notes, you are unable to import things like audio files, uh, documents, pictures, video. You can import ENEX files, Evernote proprietary ENEX files, but they have to be strictly text-based. They can't have any attachments. None of those will come over if you try to import. I will say that both apps imported data from Evernote very well. They both imported it very quickly. Uh, the, the main difference being that uh, if you are in UpNote, you can import just about any file out there. To a note and as I mentioned earlier simple note you can't do any of that as far as importing notes do go uh, simple note will import the JSON simple note files markdown files or the Evernote proprietary enix files and both do a very good job but again simple note is strictly text-based notes as long as the notes are strictly text-based they will import correctly. UpNote, on the other hand, can import text, basic text, Markdown, HTML, Simple Note, Evernote, documents, and audio files that I mentioned earlier. Simple Note does not offer a rich text editor, as you see. We are in the body of a note at the moment. We have a note open, but there's absolutely zero rich text editing options. UpNote, on the other hand, has a very full-featured rich text editor where you can highlight, bold, italic, underline, strike through, etc., etc. It offers just about everything you could possibly want in a Notes app. In summary, I will say that Simple Note is probably for someone that just wants simple text-based notes. It also offers no security, no encryption whatsoever in transit or at rest, so that's something to keep in mind when you think about what kind of notes you want to keep inside of Simple Note. UpNote handles text-based notes great. You can get rich text editing, ability to handle documents well, 
and the app is very intuitive. And you can also log in via your Google sign-in for two-factor authentication, so it's more secure than SimpleNote. So with all that being said, which note-taking app would you use? Leave your comments and like and subscribe.